Joe, you're down here at uh, Stubby's ABC, where uh, we've got Kurt and our old boys down here. And you brought a few lads down, it's been a little spa day. Let's go on that. Let's get the rooms in this. Two weeks on Saturday, I fight on September. Yeah, two weeks Saturday, the, uh, the 11th at uh, the Bolton White's Hotel. It's changed that, hasn't it? Then, yeah, yeah, well, it's to be white, but it's Bolton football ground, isn't it? Yeah. The University, the Stadium of the University of Bolton, I think it is. But it's uh, a great venue and uh, a fantastic place to make your debut. And from what I've just seen, it looks like you're ready, mate. No, no, no. I've been waiting for that. 18 months now, that fight. But do you know something? This, you're only young, like you're still only 19, and I think the experiences that you've had over the last 12 months have been quite phenomenal because you, you sparred Zelda Barrett, you sparred Dalton Smith, Smith. Yeah. you know, you've moved around with these kids here. Um, this must give you some great confidence to go forward and moving around with them and being asked to come back on several occasions. Yeah, uh, Grant Smith ran me up a few weeks ago I met with him for Dalton's last spa. But um, I, I had my driving test, so <laughs> didn't go. Yeah. Just, yeah, she said. <laughs> He's good though, isn't he? Yeah, it's been. Yeah. And then, like you say, you know, Zelfer on your doorstep. You should have made your debut on the Black Flash show uh, a few months ago, but uh, unfortunately that didn't happen. Yeah. Now we get the pleasure of it on our show on the 11th. Um, do we have any idea of an opponent? Oh, well, that's it. You know, Jamie Quinn, he is the, uh, <laughs> he's, the he's, he's, he's one of the better of the journeymen. One of the, uh, the kids that actually, if you're not on your top game, could quite easily turn you over. Yeah. You nervous? <laughs> well, he's not going to be, though, is he? You know that. I think, well, you think about you'll be about 117 or 118 fights. Yeah, that he had. Well, in fact, I was there on his debut at uh, Woodenshaw where, where he won his debut. But the kids got a cheer on him, and as a lightweight, bloody huge. You don't really get stopped team, does it? Or, no. You don't really stop that five times. Five times, on it. Yeah, yeah. Like, say, 114, 117 fights, something like that. Quite phenomenal. Yeah. Um, a, a, a real gentleman, one of the. I'd say, obviously, his stable mate was Willie Warrington, who was respected by everyone. Yeah. Well, what, what, are your, what are your aspirations now then? Because you've moved around with all these kids. Where do you feel you can go? Because you're, you're a guy, as all we uh, Brundell lads are, all unboxed as amateurs. You've all come through the white colour circuit. Yeah. Um, now, even though you're very successful on that circuit, doesn't give you an idea of where you stand in the pro game. So, how do you feel now? Now you've moved around with some of the some of the best lads and some of the lads who, I mean, the kids that you've been moving around here today probably are going to be future opponents in those early learning fights of yours. Yeah, uh, overly, I think we can go to the top. I'm going to learn stick with each. Yeah. So, like I say, you, you feel that what? A couple of years, yeah. get you to where you want. There you go, back down. Get to 21 and then we can assess where you're going to be because you don't even know really what weight you're going to be at. I mean, yeah. you're not much over uh, your fighting weight of lightweight, but at 19 you've probably still got a bit of growing and still room to get in as a bigger lightweight than you are now. I think, I'm not, I think it was now still 11 this morning, I've been that now, like that, on the day. See, if, if you were another two years older, we'd be talking super featherweight for you, wouldn't we? Yeah. But that's not really worth contemplating that at your well, age, is it? Super featherweight, but we don't want to yet. No, it's all worth it, not at your age. Because you, you've still got at least probably 18 months of growing, haven't you? Yeah. So, have you got any... Um, what, 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 what's your what's your hope for on, on uh, two weeks on Saturday? What's your... Get the win. Look good. Look good? Can't have anything silly. Get the win. Why are we saying 1-0 to you on Saturday night? million percent. <laughs> Joe, we'll leave it at that mate. But you're looking in good shape and you're looking like uh, you're definitely ready for this debut. Take care Joe. Cheers, mate.
Every, every one of his punches. Okay. Just saying, every one of Joel's punches hurt. Yeah, he's wicked, Joel. He's good in.